Hello Fire Signs, Aries, Sagittarius and Leo. Thanks for tuning into your weekly tarot reading. I'll be using a couple of decks to see what messages come up for you for the week ahead. And of course, I really appreciate you being here and joining me on the channel. Uh, if you were after a private reading, please feel free to email me. Okay, you can um, find my email in the about me section of my channel. Um, otherwise, we'll get into the reading and we'll see what comes up. What's the weekly um, theme for you? Fire signs. Okay, beautiful. You've got a weekly theme of love. So you're connecting on a very powerful level. Um, you may be connecting with a soulmate or a twin flame. These people are destined to be together. So love is all, you know, it's really heightened for you. It's all up there. Um, becoming ex exclusive. She almost looks pregnant. So for some of you, there's a conception that may happen. Now, um, you're transforming love. We've got the dragonfly, okay? It's, it's a transformation or it's a new, possibly a new love that's coming in. Um, but I get strong twin flame, soulmate vibes with this. Um, you're making growth together. You're, you're making something grow or you're growing as individuals or you're making your relationship grow. Um, this is really wonderful. Okay, things are happening fast. A lot of fast developments happening here fire signs um some of you are falling in love wow okay queen of cups to me she's like she falls in love look how adoringly she looks at this um she looks at this chalice i mean don't we all want to be looked at like that it's just this is really beautiful i think you can expect some really emotional highs here um, you know what comes to mind? I get the sense that someone is going to do something here for you this week and it's going to make you feel like you're falling in love with them or it's actually going to be the moment where you realize you are in love with them, you felt back in love with them or just why you fell in love with them in the first place. Um, I get the sense because the Six of Pentacles is like a very sweet or generous thought or um, gesture and I get the sense that something very meaningful is happening in love. Um, it may be talking about the future. It may be someone doing very something very special for an anniversary, or it may be someone doing something for you when they know you're having a hard time. The vibe I'm getting is that they're gonna, you know, someone's gonna do something super special and very very thoughtful, and they're going to do that for you because they love you, and it's just very powerful and it's going to put you in such a balanced mood this is balanced love as well so for a lot of you things have been one-sided you know you've been the only one putting in effort or energy or it's been this person that um you know they have been always texting or messaging suddenly very suddenly and i think it has to do with this this thing that's going to happen um which you know we don't want to say too much about because it's going to take away from the surprise it's going to make you realize how much this person cares or how invested they are or how much you mean to them and it's something that's going to sit very well with you and the knight of swords tells me that this is going to happen very fast and it may even feel like a part of you this week feels like a bit frazzled because of how fast things develop or how fast you fall or how fast things could change like almost overnight um this could even be like some of you coming out of the friend zone here um but overall the energies uh it's almost like it'll happen so fast and yeah, I mean, you're sitting as the six in the middle here. So it's definitely, I think, I think someone's doing this for you. They're balancing things out. But with the dragonfly, this is new love, new transformation. And you have the tree of life. It, you know, seeing that tree of life, this is a big decision. This is something huge. So, um seeing this in the cards it makes me think like your love life is being transformed or this connection going from an innocent flirtation or some banter or just a crush it's really going to be it's really stepping it up a lot um and it's really going to be very very special from that point and 
it. I'm so intrigued because I feel like I want to know what it is and I want to talk about it. But um, it's just going to be very meaningful to you. It may even bring tears. You know, it could be a very emotional thing that happens here. Um, but I also feel like for some of you, uh, someone's coming in with confessing their feelings. Okay, especially with like saying, I love you. I've fallen for you so fast. I'm in love. You know, that they're begging, they're pleading to be with you. Even borderline desperation for some. The, king, the Knight of Swords is desperate and the Six of Pentacles. You can see if you're the Pentacle here, it's like the people are begging you. The, the person, the ex, the lover, the one who wants to come back into your life. Um, it's like they're begging you. You know, I want to be back together. Um, I want to transform our love. I want to have a baby. You know, take me back. You know, especially if, maybe if some of you are finding out that you're welcoming in a child. Um maybe that's maybe that's the message that's coming up here so that is very powerful um i also feel like if something has gone wrong or someone's sort of done something to, to upset you um they're going to act quickly in making that better again. I don't see them sort of kicking back, not doing anything and just waiting. You know, I don't see ego coming into the picture. I get the sense that they're going to act quickly. The Knight of Swords is like acting with urgency. Now, there could also be something that urgently needs to be addressed as well, Earth Signs. And it's about a love connection. Now, it's a big thing. It's a big thing that you need to talk about and you've possibly left it up until now and you've been, you know, in this love connection and you've been clouded by all the amazing, beautiful things and that's fine, but there's something that needs to be discussed um, and it's like time is ticking. It's something urgent, like um, a deadline for a visa or um, you feel like someone's going to find out something, so you need to tell them. It's something that it's sort of like adding pressure um, or it's like time is of the essence um, somehow. So, I mean, it could be you, if you're the red figure, if you're the figure in red, um, you know, the red cloak, the red, uh, if this is your energy, um, then I feel like it's you that needs to act with urgency. It's fire energy. So very interesting reading. Um, I'll leave it at that though. Thanks for tuning in, of course. Um, don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Um, if you are after private reading, please feel free to reach out directly. Otherwise, I'm sure I'll catch you very, very soon. So take care, everyone, and um, all the best.